if you want to reset your component marks, you push that button. Now, it's not advisable to do that after you've issued drawings to your customer or to your fabrication shop. So a warning will come up and, and tell you that if you do this, it will reset those marks. Now we can actually reset the marks on a particular component type as well. Now if I click reset, it's going to go through and tell me that there's a message that says that the last thing you want to do is this after you've issued drawings. I don't want to continue, so I'm going to cancel out and cancel out of it. Resetting component marks is usually used when you've been working on your project and you've had consolidation going in the background, but you've made a lot of changes and all of your component marks are not in order or you've got gaps in your component marks. It's best to do that rather than try and order or organize your marks manually. If you can do that before you issue your drawings, it's always recommended. If you've already kept a list of your marks as you go um, and you're consolidating and keeping your marks up to date as you go, then resetting marks is probably most likely not an option for you. We've also got the same thing for welded members. So welded members, uh, you can reset your welded members. In most cases, if you do reset your welded members, they will most likely stay the same depending on your tree structure order. So if you've reordered items, such as you know grouping them into folders like mine, I've got third floor beams all in one floor, I might add another floor beam in there, and then that would mean that my fourth floor, which could be further down, but in this case I've got first floor and second floor down further, because I did my third floor before I did my first and second. I could reorder by grabbing that item folder with all of those welded members in there, and drag it up above. And when I do that and I hit reset welded marks, you'll probably find that my marks may change. If I leave the structure as is and I do a reset of my welded members, they should stay the same. However, a warning will come up and tell you that it will reset those marks before you proceed.